Hello Numbskullians, and today we have something very special to show you. You may have seen our official Crush Team Racing nitro fueled merchandise already, but we'd like to give you a very behind the scenes look at pretty much everything step by step. Um, not sure if you caught our live stream before, but we did already show the cream of the crop, which is the Crash Bandicoot incense burner. Um, we showed this on the live stream in great detail, um, but we explained that it is a prototype and we thought now that we have a more finalised version, we'd show you the differences and show you um, what the differences are and what, how much better quality it is because, yeah, we are always improving these things, so as, as promised, the final version is legitimately better than what this prototype is, and the prototype already looked pretty cool as it is. Um, in case you don't already know the basics about the incense burner, it is, of course, a, uh, uh, a figurine, a statue of Crash Bandicoot in his car, and at the back here, if we turn it around, you can lift this bit up, place an incense cone, a lit incense cone in there, maybe blow it out before you put this back on, and smoke will come out of the exhaust. Of course, if you're not into incense, you can just use it as an awesome displayable statue. And yeah, this is one of my favorite items in the range. It is absolutely amazing. So when we got this boxed, more final version, I really couldn't wait to show everyone. It is amazing. So first of all, here is the packaging, just in case you love a bit of packaging, and who doesn't? It is in this awesome Crush Team Racing branded box. I'm sure some people may actually leave this in the box, and do you know what? I wouldn't blame you. It is a lovely, awesome packaging. Loads of Crush Team Racing details there. So we will unbox it, and I'm sure I'll do this completely perfectly. Um, here we go, here he is. Here he is in his box. I'll just take it out here. And immediately, the immediate difference is the weight. Of course, I can't make you feel the difference of the weight between the two. But this one is much sturdier, much more detailed. This one feels very light. Um, as it was the prototype, of course, you would expect that. So these are the differences head on. Again, this is the prototype. This is the more finished version. There may end up being a couple of different changes before it's released, but uh, it will almost certainly be just like this. Again, side on, prototype, final version, and that way. So the main differences, as I'm sure you may see on camera immediately, is this version is shiny. We have this sort of gloss effect on this one. The final version is this nice matte effect. It actually looks much, much better. Um, we've got things like on the wheel, the text is now imprinted on the wheel, whereas before there were just stickers on this one. So again, just extra little details like that. And uh, one of the biggest changes is that. Um, so on the prototype one, there isn't really any way of keeping this in. It just kind of sits there. But of course, that was not good enough for the final one. So this one clips in, has little clips. So the exhaust will stay in nice and tight and nice and snug. And again, this is weighty. It feels awesome to hold. It's got a nice bit of weight to it. It looks amazing. It just looks much better than the prototype one, in my opinion. And of course, uh, this beautiful packaging as well. So there it is. Um, we can't light it in here, unfortunately, because there are smoke alarms. Hopefully, we uh, have some footage online of it in action. But I know that about half the people that buy these things maybe don't even use the incense; they just use it as a as a figurine. And um, yeah, I will probably be putting this in my glass cabinet, which is awesome. So do let us know what you think of the updates. I'll put them side by side here again, so you can tell the difference between the two. There they are looking amazing. Of course, um, we do still have some in stock, so head to numskull.com if you haven't already pre-ordered this. Um, they will release just in time for the game, so we have this at home, just in time for when Nitro Fueled launches, and of course, a couple of extra bits behind me. There are loads of items in this range. Fluffy dice, t-shirts, snapbacks, hoodies, you name it, pin badges. There is a lot of merch in this range, and they're all really awesome. If you haven't seen those, obviously do head to numskull.com. So yeah, let us know in the comments on Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, what you think of this incense burner, if you're going to get one. We think it's awesome, obviously. Uh, so yeah, let us know. Catch you later.